Hello everyone, my name is Heather Moorfield Lang and this is my YouTube channel Tech15 and today I'm going to be telling you very quickly about an awesome drawing tool called AutoDraw. Now if you are like me, a person who can barely draw a conclusion, AutoDraw is an incredibly handy tool for drawing. It can be great for you as someone who is drawing something, putting something together. It can be great for your students who need drawing a template to be able to put something together for a presentation or a paper. Very easy to use. Um, so if you are looking to be able to go to AutoDraw, you just go to your typical URL. It is AutoDraw.com. You can find out a fast how-to or you can just click on start drawing. Now the nice thing about auto draw, you have your options over here on the left side of auto draw, draw, typing, filling, shape, you've also got color options. So let's say that I just start drawing a circle. And what's going to happen is automatically up top, I actually drew more of a square. Again, I am not an artist. Um, so it will actually, similar to our phones and our iPads and um, anything that we do with text, it will actually immediately ask, do you mean one of these shapes? And it will automatically put in different things that it thinks that we are trying to draw, even up to sushi and all different types of shapes. And then you can save them, you can save the image, you can copy the image, you can use the image for a presentation, for a paper, for a template, for something in another tool. You can do a mashup, you could do Canva, you can do all different types of things. You can use this for an infographic, um, any type of a PowerPoint or a haiku deck, whatever you might be interested in. And if you want to keep drawing, you can do that as well. So you just click on auto draw again, or you can continue to draw. So let's see, let's see if I can actually, let me see if I can maybe do a figure eight this time. And then again, it's going to ask, do you mean? Now you may not mean any of these. It is totally up to you, but maybe you did. Maybe you meant to make a particular type of symbol and it gives you all different types of options for the things that you wanted to draw. So maybe in my heart of hearts, I was trying to draw, maybe I was just trying to draw a figure eight, but maybe I was also trying to draw a light bulb. And it actually really tries to help you with what it thinks you're trying to draw and it can be very useful to help you out on drawing tools, drawing mechanisms. It actually thinks I may be trying to draw a peanut. <laughs> And so it's actually a really useful little tool to help you with kind of clip art, but also for drawing items. Um, and I really kind of think of it as the drawing version of spell check. It's the drawing check. Very easy to use, very simple. You can save your images, you can keep your images, but it's just a fun drawing tool that is out there. Wanted to share it with you here on Tech 15. Hope you enjoy it. If you like what you see on my channel, subscribe. I'll have more videos for you soon. Thanks so much. Have a great day.